For over a decade now, I have been grappling with the same question. Should I cut down the two trees I'm about to show you? The moment I laid eyes on them, I was captivated by their sheer size, majestic appearance and noble presence. Contemplating their age and the resilience they have shown in enduring various climatic and environmental challenges over time, I can't help but feel an overwhelming sense of respect and admiration for these two siblings. I believe that the largest maple among them is well over 300 years old. When you consider that the average human lifespan is around 80 years, it raises profound thoughts about the meaning of life, our own fragility, and what truly matters. Should I? Shouldn't I? That's the question. Each time I ponder this dilemma, I would set aside my chainsaw and leave with a lighter heart, yet still burdened by unanswered questions. On one hand, as a sawyer and woodworker, the allure of uncovering the hidden treasures beneath the bark of these magnificent specimens and envisioning the countless carpentry projects I could undertake is undeniable. I might even profit by selling some of the slabs. However, something inside me has always dissuaded me from cutting them down. In those moments, I question my own humanity and fear the remorse I may feel if I were to end their lives solely for personal gain. Such ambivalence. Every day, I work with logs purchased in large quantities from forestry contractors who make a living by harvesting trees from surrounding forests. Yet, when it comes to these particular trees, I hesitate. Tell me. What kind of reasoning is that? In the end, I am left with an unresolved choice. To be or not to be. Like Hamlet, I contemplate the meaning of existence and the decisions that shape our lives. The majestic trees stand as a metaphor, forcing me to confront my own mortality and grapple with the conflicting desires within me. The answer remains elusive but the journey continues. Today, I still couldn't make a decision, but I sense that the answer will reveal itself soon. At 66 years old, considering the limited time I have left, I cannot postpone this decision indefinitely. Soon, I shall return to these magnificent trees to determine if I possess the courage to bring one of them to the mill. Nope. Nope. Not today. Let's go home. <laughs>